This week in the Catholic Star Herald, praying for peace. With political and racial tensions fraught, some voices keep calling for calm and for an end to both tolerating grievous wrongs and to answering injustice with more injustice. Among those voices for peace is Sarah Gilmore, a senior at Haddonfield High School. She organized a prayerful response to raise awareness for justice and an end to violence held at Christ the King Parish in Haddonfield on November 6th. Rebuilding his life. When Miguel Rivera woke up intubated in the ICU at Jefferson Hospital, he had no memory of what happened or why he was there. While he was sleeping, the apartment building where Rivera had lived for seven years burned down. He lost everything, including his beloved dog. Because of the smoke inhalation, his lungs had been permanently damaged. After two weeks in the ICU, Rivera's sister, Maria, reached out to the Catholic Charities. We've come this far. We celebrate the contributions, achievements, and the role of black Catholics in the U.S. during the month of November. In 1990, the National Black Catholic Clergy Caucus of the United States designated the month of November to honor black Catholic heritage in the U.S. For these stories and more, visit CatholicStarHerald.org. I'm Dave Hernandez for the Catholic Star Herald.